If you've ever shopped for an inexpensive subcompact before, you know you have to keep your expectations pretty low. Most are cramped, underpowered, and a bit shaky on the overall quality. The 2013 Kia Rio doesn't fit that mold. Yep, there is nothing like it. From that clean, edgy exterior design to the roomy interior and boatload of standard and optional features, the Rio is definitely a game changer among subcompacts. You can go with either a four-door sedan or five-door hatchback and one of three trim levels, the base LX, EX, or top-of-the-line SX. But what really impressed us was how much car you're getting for way under 20 grand. It's a snap to get comfy in the front seat of the Rio, even if you're on the tall side. And the rear seat is almost as roomy for two adults, especially if the front seats aren't adjusted back all the way. True, plus the driver can find the perfect position with a standard six-way adjustable seat and tilt steering column. Honestly, it would take practically forever to list the standard and optional features on the Rio. In fact, how they can offer so much good stuff for so little money is mind-boggling. Just an example, the Uvo infotainment system that's standard on the SX and optional on the EX gives you voice control for calling friends, listening to voicemail, and calling up music from an iPod or through the stereo's own jukebox hard drive. You can also voice command music to stream from your cell phone. How trick is that? The 138 horsepower inline four in the Rio has enough power to get you there with enthusiasm, if not raw speed. If you want the six-speed manual transmission, you'll have to go with the base LX trim level since the EX and the SX are only available with a six-speed automatic. And if you want some extra rubber between you and the road, you'll want the SX trim level that includes bigger 17-inch wheels and tires. The 15-inchers on the Rio LX and EX are quiet on the highway, but they squill and screech in tight corners. Otherwise, you'll be pleasantly surprised by how well the Rio handles and performs considering it's such an inexpensive Econo car. You'll love the 28 miles per gallon fuel economy in the city and the satisfying 36 MPG on the highway with the automatic transmission. And you'll peg that up a notch with the manual. And the 2013 Rio scored four stars for overall protection and government crash tests. So are you ready for this? The base LX four door sedan stickers for under $14,000 before options, while the SX hatchback has a starting MSRP of only $17,900. And that includes Kia's very generous 10-year, 100,000-mile limited powertrain warranty. Side by side with the Honda Fit, you'll find the Rio has more power and slightly better fuel economy. Compared to the Chevy Sonic, the Rio has an edge on technology but can't match the torque of the Sonic's turbocharged engine. The Nissan Versa has more rear seat legroom and a lower base price, but the Rio has more features and that great powertrain warranty. We're still wondering how Kia's managed to include a laundry list of features in the 2013 Rio while still keeping the price within easy reach. And above all, it's fun to drive, which sets it apart from many other subcompacts out there. And that truly is a bargain.